Hello there, everyone. I'm Zach, and today I'm going to react to and review the Japanese rock band One OK Rock performing their song Renegades on their 2023 Luxury Disease Japan tour. About a month ago or so, a subscriber of mine recommended this band to me, but I didn't have the time to check them out until now. I also want to point out that a lot of bands sound better live. And I can't wait to see what the hype is about. Let's get into it. Well, that looks pretty. So, I rest my face in this broken system. Go for my home. But if it cries, there ain't one listening. What if we got a generation? We want an open conversation. All of me on this road. No, we gotta let go. All of the times that they say it's impossible. They build a herd as it was in the obstacles. I like how the song started with the woodwind sample before the drums, bass, and guitar came in all gentle and reserved, which led to the chorus being explosive yet controlled. As the instruments are well played at a high volume, the same can be said for the frontman. As he sang the verse in a soft tone, before projecting in the chorus, which sounds great. On top of that, his showmanship is really solid as it got the crowd to sing along after the chorus. This is really good. They've been holding us down. They've been telling us to change our voices. A win of all of the crowd. We're mad or big and we make our own choices. The lead vocalist singing in Japanese in the pre-chorus was a nice touch because I was feeling the connection to the Asian cultural roots between the band and myself. Also from what I'm hearing, I like the song's lyrical message 
that deals with speaking up against injustice and how the younger generations are capable of changing the world for the better. As for the awesome guitar riff in the post chorus, it blended really well with the singing crowd. I love it. Take a deep breath, scratch your eyes and get ready. Take a deep breath, scratch your eyes and get ready. Take a deep breath, scratch your eyes and get ready to fly. I'm not afraid. Throughout the whole performance, I was hearing an orchestra sample in various parts of the song, and I absolutely love it, as it gave the tune some dramatic intensity. And even though it's a rock song, that melodic composition felt similar to that of a regular pop song, which I am all for, as pop is one of my favorite genres of music. Plus, the Furnerman's falsetto notes in the choruses are pitch perfect. And I like that he raised his fists in the air at the end as a way to connect to the lyrical message. I thoroughly enjoyed it. I have a feeling that this song is going to be stuck in my head because it's very catchy and everything else was incredible. The instrumentalists did a great job capturing the uplifting vibe while sounding amazing. Speaking of sounding amazing, I love the front man for conveying the lyrical message of rebellion and positive change through a soft tone singing, solid vocal projection, and impressive falsetto notes. What made the performance even better are the visual graphics behind the band matching the vibe of the song and the crowd singing along. What a phenomenal song and performance. Thank you all for watching this video. Please check out 1OK Rock's video link in the description box below and take care.